Hello Capricorn, welcome to my channel, welcome to this coming week's reading. For this week I am reading from the coffee cup and then I'll be drawing out cards from the lovely Tarot of the Divine deck here. Okay Capricorn, please also do like, share and subscribe if you haven't done so already. I would really appreciate that and uh, do hit that notification bell also if you haven't done so already. Okay Capricorns, let's see what we have for you. Hmm... <laughs> Is somebody, I feel like, is somebody trying to meddle in your business, Capricorn? And I'm not sure if I said this to you last time. There's somebody meddling around, um, and you, you've got a big stop sign, like, that you're putting in front of them. Nope. Like that, very, very bluntly. You're just making things obvious now. You know, um, no more kind of Mr. Nice Guy. And that's, I mean, no, be nice. But I'm. this, this is what I'm seeing. Just very, very blunt. Um, and, you know, you're not worried anymore about what this person may think or that person may think anymore. You are asking somebody to just sort of leave you alone or some situation to be left alone. There's something to do with solitude as well. Perhaps some of you, this could be just for the few, but, you know, you really appreciate your solitude and maybe you're needing to be in some solitude right now because I feel like things are start, uh, going to start picking up. You know, it's like um, you're needing to really conserve your energy because... It's going to, you're going to need it. You're going to need it in a really good way. There is a calming presence or energy that is coming um, forward that's going to be around you. And it's like just what you need. Um, you know, to put your feet up, maybe a spa day. There's something that it's like, mm, it could be somebody around you that, likes to just brush things under the carpet never really getting to the source or to the root of things um and i do see you can stop that it could perhaps some of you but it's like you are you're, you're clearing the air. There's something here about really clearing the air. And there's something about finances also you're straightening out. And you're getting ready to be really serious about your finances as well. Um, I do see it's like you're trying to see all your options. Um, that could be perhaps you're purchasing something, investing in something. But trying to see the best way going forward. And I do get, for some reason, a little bit nervous, but you're, you're doing really, really well. You know, and I do see you well looked after as well, Capricorn. You are, um, there's somebody around you that is very amused by you, very attracted, very amused by you, you know, and they kind of, they really enjoy your company a lot. And that is something like, I don't know, I see makes you blush, you know, it's just makes you feel really good. It's like I see you going back home and you're like, oh, gosh, that was nice to get that kind of attention, you know. <laughs> something about borderline, like um, uh, there's only so far that you can stretch yourself or or um, keep sort of giving or, or you know, something feels very one way in a particular situation. And so it has felt a little bit uneven, but in a way it's like you feel obligated in a way and it's just something that you have to do, but it's temporary, it won't always be that way good things will come to you Capricorn because of the good that you've been doing 
you know, for another or others here. There's something about uh, listening to certain details or looking out for signs. I do see synchronicities coming your way. Hmm. Be aware of jealousies around you. Be aware of, of, of that, you know, you don't need to, like you just, you do you, you be you. Because you are the one that is light. Like there's this light, beautiful energy around you and you keep shining. You keep shining. Um, you're having uh, quite a few admirers. I do see like uh, this attraction and whatnot. You're not in a rush. You're just kind of enjoying it. <laughs> Oh, okay. Ace of Swords and Justice. Wow. All right. Oh, what do we have here? Capricorn. Oh, wow. All right. Ace of Swords, Justice and the Four of Swords. Yes, you have been trying to hash something out, battling out. I mean, you have victory on your side big time here. Big time. You've been trying to really clear the way for yourself, trying to gather everything, every little piece, everything that will help you and more like you've gone above and beyond and because of this some, something definitely does work out you get yet yeah, you get a big yes you get this achievement there is something that i see you know um others telling you how brave you are and how it's like i do get at times perhaps you felt like you were on your own or whatever it was that you were trying to uh accomplish and when you do receive this victory it's time that you look after yourself it's time that you put your feet up and you're like yeah you know um it's like you're saying to yourself i think i've i've done more than my fair share and that comic um something comic also is is feeling like the comic energy around you feels clearer like there's a cleanse there as well and like I said, something very victorious very well balanced the hermit and the nine of wands the hermit and the nine of wands i see here something is going to start to feel more real than ever things are going to start really kind of you know i get like this energy that really packs a punch i don't know why it's really interesting and you're getting ready because of that. You know, we have the Four of Swords and then the Hermit. That solitude we were talking about. Did I talk about solitude with you? I believe so. I believe so. Here we go. The solitude. Something that you need. That is really important. And then, boom, you come out. And you're like, ha ha. You couldn't, you know, I wasn't going to go away for much long, for, for that long. Can't... Uh, keep me away and it's what i do see you're extremely resourceful as well there's something about you being resourceful and knowing exactly what to do to claim some situations of victory something you know that you you've already kind of had many many experiences and that has allowed you to be persistent and to persevere keeping your head up high you've definitely acknowledged and learned a lot of things and there's something about timing listening to intuition knowing when to you know come out and 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 apply for something that you've been wanting to or like knowing when to you know put your foot on that on that pedal on that gas and to zoom to go forward And it's it's like people will not know what what hit them in in that sense, you know, the oh the nine of cups, or you know, it's it's like um, working in silence until boom you have your success, and it's like oh wow Capricorn totally didn't expect that everything seemed quiet but you know behind but you were working behind the scenes. You know, until until those curtains are drawn and that spotlight is on you to shine, as we we're talking about, to continue that light of yours, to have 
this this fulfillment that I feel like has been very deep within you and you've been working very, very hard and whatever struggles that you've had, you know, you're like thanking it because it's getting to, getting you, yourself to where you want to be. I love it. It feels very magical in a way. You know, I think it's just all the amazing synchronicities that you're getting, all the signs that you are getting, all that you have learned will make sense from your from your challenges, you know? And now it's like, ah, oh, now I feel free. I love it. We're taking charge. I love this. Thank you so very much, Capricorn, for being here. Really hope this was helpful. Please do let me know. Appreciate all of you so very, very much. Do take care. And until next time.